What's up guys, so Huawei, which is ranked as the world's leading smartphone brand, for the second quarter of this year is now struggling to keep its business running smooth, like the company, is now battling for the survival against the US sanctions and has a few tricks to solve this problem. Anyway, if you want to get video like this, subscribe to this channel will be phenomenal. Now, let's start the video. So as I told you earlier, Huawei have to work with other Chinese brands, including Oppo, Vivo and Xiaomi, in order to compete with the Google. I mean, Huawei needs to force other Chinese vendors to use its Harmony operating system and ditch Android, which is no doubt a difficult task though, like why they will ditch Android, which is the world's leading operating system. But finally, Huawei is working on the strategy, because recently, Huawei's rotating chairman said that, the company is in talks with the Chinese vendors, to expand the usage of Harmony OS, if the Chinese giants, manage to convince the smartphone makers to adopt Harmony OS, even only for the Chinese market, then it could be, a major blow to Google's Android. Right now, Huawei is making them use the Harmony OS only for the Chinese market, and it is indeed possible considering the fact that Google is not used inside of China. Every Chinese company uses their own app gallery inside of China and don't use much Google's App Store. Also they have their own social media platforms. So it is not a big deal for them to switch to Huawei's app gallery and Huawei's Harmony OS. And as far as the chipset issue of Huawei is concerned in the international market, almost every company is now trying hard to do partnership with Huawei. If you don't know, recently AMD and Intel confirmed that they have been granted a license by the United States to continue doing business with Huawei, which is a good news though, but the scope is not yet known. Apart from them, MediaTek and SMIC have also applied for a license to supply chipsets to Huawei. So I hope this issue will be resolved soon. Well, I know the US ban is not letting Huawei to make phones, but they can make PCs and monitors. Well recently, a well-known source said that Huawei is now making PCs and monitors, the Chinese tech giant looking to launch a curved gaming monitor series, which is no doubt a great move though. Furthermore, the company had also recently launched a workstation desktop, however, this was only aimed at developers and not the consumers, but the conference from today revealed that, Huawei will soon launch, desktop PCs for consumers as well. Anyway, what's your thoughts on this move from Huawei? Do let me know your thoughts, on that in the comments down below. And if you like this video, subscribe to the channel will make my day, and my name is Arjun, this is Digital Outside, I'll catch you guys, in the next one. Say, cause I fuck it up